Hi guys, welcome to SA Technical. If you are seeing a message like no audio device installed or no audio device found on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 PC, don't worry. Today I will walk you through some quick and effective way to fix this problem step by step. So let's get started. First, we need to make sure that your Windows audio services are working properly. To do that, click on search bar and type services. Open the services app. Now scroll down and locate Windows Audio Service. Double click it and set the setup type to automatic. If the services is not running, click start, then apply and OK. Now look for any HD audio related services here. If you find any services related to HD audio here, make sure that running too. Now restart your computer. If the problem is not fixed yet, the next step is to update your driver sense system. Right click on the start button and choose settings. Navigate to the windows update then advanced option. After that optional windows updates. Under driver updates look for any update related to audio and install them. Also I will suggest you to update your full windows system too because fresh windows updates often fix hidden issues. Next, let's check the device manager. First, right click on the start menu and choose device manager. Next, expand audio inputs and outputs. Right click on your audio device like high definition audio device and make sure it is enabled. After that, select update driver and click search automatically for drivers. And here also I'll suggest you to expand sound, video and games controllers and repeat the same process.
If you don't see your audio devices, click view. After that, show hidden devices. If still missing, click on your desktop account name, choose action and click scan for hardware changes. If your audio devices are still missing or not working, you can manually uninstall and let Windows reinstall them. In Device Manager, right click on your audio device under Audio Input Outputs and Sound, Video and Game Controllers. Select Uninstall Device. After that, restart your computer. Now Windows will reinstall drivers automatically. Let's make sure the correct audio device is set as default. Go to settings, then system and click sound. Scroll down and click more sound settings. Under the playback tab, right click on your correct device and set it as default. After that, double click the device. Now check enhancement tab for any audio enhancement that might help. Now here, I'll suggest you to disable any audio enhancement related settings. Perform a phrase and clean driver installation process. Go to the official website of your PC manufacturer like Dell, HP, Lenovo or the audio device manufacturer like Realtek, Intel, etc. Find the support or driver section. Now download the latest version of your audio driver compatible with your Windows version. Make sure you get the .zip file version or the driver package. Sometimes manufacturer include a folder full of files with one .inf file. That's what you will need. If you downloaded a .zip file, Right click and select extract all. Now you should have a folder with many files. Now you will need to find the audio driver.inf file. This is the installer script Windows uses. Now right click on start menu and select device manager. Expand sound video game controllers. Right click on your current audio driver. For example, Realtek High Definition Audio and select Uninstall Device. Check the box that says Delete the software for this device. Now click Uninstall. Now restart your computer. After restarting, open the device manager again. Now the audio device may show up as unknown device or high definition audio device under other devices. Next, right click on device. Select Update Driver. Click Browse My Computer for Drivers. Then click Let Me Pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. Select Sound Video Game Controllers. Click Have Disk. This option allows manual.inf installation. Now browse to the folder where you extracted the new audio driver. Select the .inf file inside the folder. Click open, then click OK and click on next. Keep patience, Windows will now install the audio driver manually using that .inf file. After the installation is finishes, check the device manager. Your audio device should now display properly. Now right click it, click on properties and check if it says the device is working properly under device status. I hope one of these steps should definitely help to fix no audio device installed issues on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 system. 
So, I hope this guide was helpful for you. If you have any question, then please let us know. Please like, comment and share. We need your support. And guys, please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.